And we are back, everybody. Welcome to another episode of Minecraft. I need to get rid of that dick. It's really pissing me off. It's getting in the way of my intros. You know, I wanted to be centered on the sun, but this big dick's in the way. So I gotta be turning all this way. It sucks. Ah, oh, crap. I cheat. Uh, I have my macro key set up now. Uh, it's great. Over here... We have our castle, and over here I started uh, making these uh, item elevators. Well, and we're going to have a huge base underground the size of the castle footprint. Let me uh, fix my mic. There, that's better. I'm not spitting into it all the time now. Back here, I created a giant tower going all the way up so that way I can AFK and uh, collect a bunch of mob loot which seems to be working by the way I uh, I have a an elevator design that will fit in here a 5x5 five five, but I don't I don't quite like it so I'm gonna I'm gonna see if I can find something else I want to be able to select which floor that I go to that would be nice ooh oh yeah so worth it not yet not yet as soon as that chest is full then it's worth it just wanted to come over here and show you guys this. So, what's going on? I don't know. Over here we have the uh, the tower. And it goes all the way up to 178, I believe. Uh, see, in here I have these vines that we can go up. I planted vines all across the upside there. So, uh, that way... Uh, this whole thing will be vines, and then you can just walk up to a wall and then climb up. It'll be great. Uh, I only want those entrances right there at the bottom. Uh, I was thinking about a spiral staircase going around, but I don't want to do that again. That thing takes forever, and I never go up it. So there's no real point in having it. Uh, I might just do a piston elevator in the center here, though, uh, which is not a bad idea. And then a drop down. Here we are at the top. I made this little uh, nipple thing to stand on. It's, it's not. It's not terrible. Um, it seems to be right at the sweet spot for this uh, mob. <gasps> oh! Everything was acting weird for a second. Maybe it's just me. I'm pretty weird. There we go. You can already see it in action. Oh yeah, that's great. I have a beer with me today. It's a Guinness Blonde. It's an American lager. It's delicious. It's so crisp. Don't drink. It's bad for you. <gasps> oh my goodness. I keep having heart attacks. I need to put water down there. Ooh, that's a great idea. I could put water down there. That'd be awesome. I kind of want to bring it up to like almost this height and then have this coming out. I also thought about just leaving it there and then capping it off. I'll probably just build it up. What am I talking about? I'm just being lazy now. I built that tower over there. I was going to build it up to be this. It's considerably smaller. But then I realized that uh, it's way too far away to activate the mob farm. Look at that. It's like at the edge of the chunks. I think I have, what, eight chunks loaded? Oh, I wonder I'm lagging. There we go. That's a lot better. I'm getting 34 FPS. That's great. I have it locked at 30. There we go. Now I'm actually getting the FPS that I should. Woohoo! Uh, oh! Okay, we're gonna try to do this. Nope, no! Oh, I just got shivers. Okay. Well, that sucked. And here we are. It's currently a few days later. I, uh, I rage quit a little bit there. Uh, even though it was my fault. Anyways, we have uh, an I, uh, not item elevator, an elevator inside here. And uh, it has a call button. That's what just happened. It, it came back down. Let's uh, go ahead and take it up. It's pretty good. It's it's very compact, but it's not fast at all. As you can see, I'm getting one, two, three, four, five, six, like two blocks a second. One Mississippi, two Mississippi, three Mississippi. Yep, how about that? It's not too bad. And here we are. Whoa, you can see lights coming through from the pistons. That's cool. Uh, I went ahead and built this up. Uh, you can go ahead and look at the wiring here, but I'm sure you can just go uh, online and find one. This one's fairly compact because it's only one block. 
Uh, here's the flying unit using observer blocks in that format. Yeah. This one's facing up and that one's facing down. So here we are activating the mob system. Yep. It's pretty good. Whee! And over here I made an automatic farm. It's not fully automatic, but I mean it washes it away. And uh, Ashley wrote me that. It washes it away, and I'm going to eventually set up a villager, so that way he can uh, go ahead and go through there and replant. And over here, I have our uh, item elevator uh, slash storage silo. Uh, it's very difficult to, uh, to use. It doesn't have the display correct. I have to fix that. I don't know why it's doing it. But uh, let's go ahead and throw some carrots in there. It uses pistons, so it's... Uh, Pretty good. I built this entrance to go into the house. Alright, let's come up here. Hopefully we can see it. Seriously? Okay, so those turn on. And then when they're done, I guess that one turns off. I don't I don't know. That's dumb. I need to fix it. Alright, so I went ahead and fixed these. They work pretty good now. Oh, man. Oh, I forgot to make all these like this. Hang on. Alright, there, I fixed it again. Alright, so now it's fixed. Uh, let's see. So let's go ahead and throw some stuff in here. The display doesn't work at all how I want it to, but that's okay. Oh, shoot. I forgot to count Mississippi's. No, let's see if we can make it. No, nope, not that one. Yes, this one. Alright, so they all light up full when it's going. And then when it's done... Oh, that was a good timing. Yeah, and then just two of them are active. So, you know, whatever. I'll come back and fix it in a million years. Uh, I'm sure. But until... Ooh. Oh yeah, that's right. Until then, I thought I found a cave. <laughs> that's mine. Until then, uh, let's go ahead and uh, fix that farm. Alright, here we go. So, I went ahead and uh, added on all the fancy stuff. Here's a tunnel that I can eventually get a villager to go through. And uh, Piston retracts this block. Let's go ahead and move that out of the way. Put that back. Thank you very much. And, uh, so... What happens is this signal that comes up here, the uh, double pulse, with like probably like 10 seconds between them, uh, runs over here. I have it repeating to an inverter, which is also part of a clock. I have an output coming over here. Oh man. Oh, I just realized the piston's set up on the... Okay, well anyways, the... The piston was set up on the clock. I'll fix it later, but you get the general idea. Uh, there's a clock that goes here and shoots uh, stuff out of the dispenser. Seeds. And the villager comes over here. He picks them up, says, Ooh, I must plant. And then he plants them all, and then we wash away the farm when they're ready again in the next day cycle. Whew. Which, uh, I never really explained this earlier too well. Uh, so I have the daylight sensor coming here, inverter, uh, block detector, uh, monostable circuit output to a two tick delay, uh, running over here pretty quick, which sends the first pulse up there firing all the dispensers. And the second pulse comes over here delaying like, oh gosh, I don't know, someone do the math if you care. Uh, that many delay. Let's see, that's one, two, three, four, five times. Uh, three plus two, one repeat. I don't know. It's a lot. A lot of delay. Oh, I forgot to mention the craziest thing happened to me. So I was just playing one day, you know, over here, coming and picking up my stuff, and then I put it all on, and then a thunderstorm happened, and then zap! A bunch of these mofos! Showed up. Oh my gosh, four of them simultaneously. I was down to half a heart when I kicked their asses. I mean arses. I mean donkeys. 
But that's freaking awesome. I went ahead and put saddles on them. Did you know they're already tamed? That's pretty cool. At least these ones were. I don't know if that's a bug or supposed to happen, but I have never seen one of these in Minecraft. I've never played with them. I've never looked at them. And out of nowhere, I just got them. It's great. I love it. Alright, so... Ooh. I didn't mean to do that. So what I want to do right now is actually go ahead and set up uh, my shutters. I haven't had those in a while, huh? Yeah. They're going to look nice. I don't know if you guys know what those are, but I have a whole bunch of uh, pistons that go... Choo -choo -choo and retract all the way down and then uh, retract up and then I've got my chest display I'll probably do it for just two ah, that's plenty Wahaha, it works so here's the basic concept so we got a wire coming here we got a delay it doesn't really matter it can just go straight to it we got a one tick delay a two tick delay a three tick delay and a four tick delay the fourth tick goes to the next segment, which then goes one, two, three, and etc. Now how this works is you press a button and it does magical things. If you want to get scientific. But uh Yeah, that's pretty much what I'm gonna do. I'm gonna go ahead and set up an inverter for it though. I got so many stuff in my pockets. So when we come over here oh man oh I got rid of my staircase. We come over here. Oh yeah. Of course it'll be hooked up to a lever or some sort of T flip flop jigger. I turned shaders off because it sucks when it's dark. I'll go ahead and turn that back on. I'm sorry you guys had to see normal Minecraft. It's ugly, I know. There we go, it's much better. Now everything's dark and really saturated and disgusting. Let's come back. Oh no, it's raining. Oh yeah, I built another portal over here. Perfect time to go to the nether to show you guys uh, what I've done in there. Lots of cool stuff since I started. Oh yeah, we're talking big things. And loading. Oh yeah, are you ready for this? I've done absolutely nothing. I built this box around it when I first went on. Filled filled uh, all these chests with cobble for just in case like I always do and then just started harvesting stuff got a bunch of quartz I didn't get all the stuff in this area because I didn't want to damage the landscape you know me beauty and all that there's a huge lava pool over here yeah when I spawned out a uh, zombie pigman came behind me scared the crap out of me so I went forward almost fell off the edge where is he don't try anything yeah, huge lava pool. Uh, for some reason, I get way better frame rate in the nether. I don't know why, but it works. Probably because of all the sunlight. I don't know. But in normal Minecraft, you get way more lag in the nether. It's pretty bad. But I think that's uh, that's all we're going to do today. Uh, I went ahead and did the farm, did a whole bunch of other stuff. This is like two weeks after I started this episode. So that just goes to show how much time I have available in my schedule. So it'll probably be a while since my next episode. But until then, I'll see you guys next time.